Did you ever think that a forest could hold secrets that challenge the very boundaries of what we believe to be possible? Imagine a world where ancient stones align in mysterious formations akin to Stonehenge, where crystal caves shimmer in hidden corners, and where entire forests lie beneath the surface, waiting to be uncovered. Picture the enigmatic city of Z, a lost civilization that has baffled explorers and historians for centuries. Today, we're not just exploring the Amazon, the world's largest tropical rainforest, which is larger than the combined size of the UK and Ireland, 17 times over. From underground wonders to the traces of ancient societies, we are peeling back the layers of the unknown. We are unraveling its secrets, bringing you face to face with the 12 most mysterious discoveries ever made deep within its heart. Number 12, Amazon Stonehenge. Picture this, deep in the jungle, far away from skyscrapers and busy streets, there's a place that's throwing scientists for a loop. It's called the Amazon Stonehenge. Now I know what you're thinking, Stonehenge, like the massive rock circle in England? Yep, you've got it. Except this one is surrounded by trees, not sheep. We're talking about huge stones, all lined up in a circle right in the middle of the jungle. It's like someone way back when decided to play a massive game of dominoes, but then left their masterpiece behind. And here's where it gets cool. Some people think that this jungle Stonehenge was used to track the stars. Yeah, you heard that right. We've got ancient astronomers in the house. Imagine living in a world without calendars or clocks and you had to rely on the sky to know when to plant your crops or celebrate the new year. That's exactly what these stones could have been for. A gigantic natural calendar. Now, we're not 100% sure if that's what it was used for, and that's what makes it so intriguing. It's a puzzle waiting to be solved, a riddle from the past. So, what do you think? Could there be more hidden Stonehenges out there lost in the jungles? Drop a comment and let's crack this jungle mystery together. And stay tuned, because we've got even more mind-blowing discoveries coming up next. Number 11. Ancient Geoglyphs Now are you ready for a trip from the skies to the ground? Next up, we've got something that'll make you say, Wait, what is going on here? We're talking about ancient geoglyphs, hidden right under the lush green carpet of the Amazon jungle. Yeah, you heard that right. The Amazon has its very own version of the Nazca Lines. If you have never heard of the Nazca Lines in Peru, you've got to check out our video about them and other mysteries around the world. I added the link for you in the description. So, picture this. Gigantic drawings sprawled across the ground, strange patterns and figures all carved into the earth. But here's the catch. You can't just fly a plane over and spot them like in Peru. No, sir. These Amazonian geoglyphs are playing a fantastic game of hide-and-seek under the forest canopy. You'd need to be a bit of an Indiana Jones, venturing into the jungle or staring at satellite images to catch a glimpse of these mysterious shapes. They're like secret messages from an ancient civilization. And boy, were they good at keeping secrets. Now, the brain buzz. What were they for? A dance floor for ancient parties? Or maybe a place to connect with the gods? Or could it be something as down-to-earth as farming or finding your way through the jungle? Archaeologists are scratching their heads and the jury is still out. Number 10. Crystal Caves Now let's dive deep into the heart of the Amazon to explore something straight out of a fairy tale. It's about the enchanted caverns, a breathtaking and mesmerizing natural wonder crystal caves of unparalleled beauty. These caves have been left relatively untouched for thousands of years. Known as the Enchanted Caverns, these Amazon crystal caves are far from the well-traveled paths of modern explorers. What sets them apart are the massive gypsum crystals that decorate the walls and floors of the caves. These crystals have had plenty of time to form, free from human interference. The cave conditions have allowed these crystals to grow to impressive sizes, with some of them reaching several meters in length and shining with an otherworldly glow. Witnessing these natural formations is genuinely mesmerizing and sparks a sense of wonder among those fortunate enough to see them. Scientists and geologists are particularly interested in these caves because they offer a unique opportunity to study the geological processes behind crystal formation. They're also looking into the potential for discoveries related to extremophiles, organisms that thrive in extreme conditions, since the cave environment is unlike any other on Earth. So imagine being one of the lucky few to set foot in these caves. Would it feel like stepping into another dimension? Number 9. The Underground Forest In the depths of the Amazon jungle, where the canopy is so dense that little sunlight reaches the forest floor, you'll find a fascinating natural phenomenon the underground forest. 
This unique ecosystem is home to plants that have adapted to thrive beneath the jungle's surface. The thick canopy of the Amazon rainforest blocks most sunlight, which makes it a challenging environment for plants that rely on photosynthesis. To adapt, some plant species have evolved to grow underground. These subterranean plants have developed unique traits, such as bioluminescent properties and specialized root systems that can extract nutrients from decaying organic matter. This bioluminescence helps the plants find nutrients and plays a role in attracting insects and other organisms for pollination and seed dispersal. Number eight, Amazon's Blood Red Waterfall. Deep within this lush, vibrant paradise, there's a waterfall like no other. It's not your usual cascade of clear, rushing water. Nope, this one is a staggering shade of crimson. Welcome to the Amazon's Blood Red Waterfall, a spectacle that truly defies belief. Now, I know what you're thinking. A red waterfall? No way. But believe it or not, it's as real as it gets. This natural wonder has baffled visitors and scientists alike. What's the secret behind this vivid display? Enter Serratia marchesians, a fascinating bacterium with a penchant for the dramatic. This microorganism releases prodigiosin, a pigment that not only gives it a distinctive color, but also turns the entire waterfall into a flowing cascade of blood. Now. You might be wondering, why red? Prodigiosin isn't just your average pigment. It's a secondary metabolite, which means the bacteria produce it under specific conditions, usually when they're under stress or in a competitive environment. The red pigment gives them a survival advantage, helping to fend off other microbes and secure their place in the ecosystem. And while it might look otherworldly, this red waterfall is a perfect example of nature's incredible ability to adapt and thrive even in the most unexpected places. Have you ever seen anything like this before? It might sound like something out of a science fiction movie, but this phenomenon is 100% natural and it doesn't harm the environment one bit. Isn't nature just mind blowing? So here's a fun challenge for you. Can you think of any other places on earth where water defies its usual blue or green colors? Number seven, the city of Z. Have you ever heard of the City of Z or the legendary El Dorado, a city thought to be full of gold? The City of Z is a legend that comes from the accounts of the conquistadors, those old explorers who went deep into the Amazon searching for riches. They were looking for El Dorado, a city rumored to be covered in gold. The name El Dorado actually means the golden one in Spanish, and it all started with a tribe in Colombia where a king would cover himself in gold dust and jump into a lake as an offering to the gods. British explorer Percy Fawcett was fascinated by this story. He believed there was a hidden city in the Amazon full of treasures and he called it the City of Z. Fawcett thought this place was more than just gold. He believed it was an advanced civilization lost in time. He believed the City of Z was a refuge for people fleeing the destruction of Atlantis, hoping to uncover a treasure trove of knowledge. Despite countless challenges and previous failed expeditions, Fawcett's faith in the existence of the City of Z never wavered. His memoirs, filled with stories of the extraordinary, reveal his unconventional beliefs and encounters, including tales of massive anacondas, strange creatures, and unknown objects reminiscent of ancient Egypt. Fawcett was intrigued by artifacts he found, although he was not convinced by pottery sherds, as recent archaeological discoveries have highlighted extensive ancient civilizations in the Amazon. Fawcett's vision of the city of Z was grand. Influenced by rumors of ruins resembling European cities, white Indians, and his connections with the spiritualism movement, he believed in a White Lodge, a place holding sacred teachings from Atlantis. While Fawcett's beliefs in the city of Z captivate our imaginations, they were a product of their time, blending a willingness to believe, spirituality, and unfortunately, a pejorative view of indigenous people. The city of Z, for many, remains a symbol of adventure, mystery, and the allure of the unknown. Number six, the Boiling River. Nestled amidst the lush, unforgiving expanse of the Peruvian Amazon, a river of staggering heat courses through the jungle, its waters bubbling and steaming as if kissed by an unseen flame. This is Shanae Timpishka, known colloquially as the Boiling River a serpentine body of water that weaves through the dense foliage guarded by towering walls of vibrant green. As the river snakes its way across the landscape, its azure waters, capable of reaching a scalding 200 degrees Fahrenheit, dance over stones of pristine ivory, 
creating a stark and mesmerizing contrast. The river, stretching nearly four miles, holds a sacred place in the hearts of the local inhabitants. It is a realm of both danger and sanctity, believed to possess potent healing powers and frequented by shamans for its mystical properties. The legend of Yakumama, the mother of the waters, is etched into the narrative of this river. This colossal serpent spirit, revered and feared in equal measure, is said to birth both hot and cold waters, imparting the boiling river with its formidable heat. A stone shaped like a snake's head marks the beginning of this treacherous waterway, a silent guardian to the secrets held within. Despite its breathtaking appearance, the river is as dangerous as it is stunning, with water temperatures ranging from 120 to nearly 200 degrees Fahrenheit and depths reaching up to 16 feet. The riverbank's mud is too hot to walk on, and any human would sustain third-degree burns within a second of falling in. The source of the boiling river's heat is geological. It flows over a series of hot springs, and the high levels of geothermal activity in the region contribute to its incredibly high temperature. For the local indigenous people, the river holds mythological significance and is considered a place of healing. Number 5. The Giant Pebus Lake System the Amazon Basin conceals a prehistoric secret of massive proportions, the remnants of a vast wetland system called the Giant Peebus Lake System. This ancient ecosystem, now a rich source of fossilized treasures, once hosted extraordinary megafauna. The Giant Peebus Lake System existed during the Miocene epoch, around 13 million years ago, and covered a sprawling area of what is now the Amazon Basin. It was a network of interconnected lakes and waterways home to giant creatures that roamed the landscape. Fossils discovered in this region include the remains of massive turtles, enormous crocodiles, and even ancient aquatic sloths. These exceptional fossils offer valuable insights into the unique ecosystems and biodiversity of the Amazon basin in ancient times. For paleontologists, the giant Peebus lake system offers a glimpse into the distant past, shedding light on the Amazon's evolution and the creatures that once thrived in this extraordinary environment. Number 4. The Hidden Mountains While we often think of the Amazon basin as vast stretches of rainforest, it also conceals an astonishing geological feature, the hidden mountains of the White Peak Range. These mountains have remained entirely concealed by the dense canopy, making them one of the Amazon's most puzzling discoveries. These mountains earned the name White Peak, due to the pale color of the quartzite rocks that form their summits. Their isolation and the thick vegetation that engulfs them have hidden them from the outside world for centuries. The quartzite rocks that form the summits of the White Peak Range are believed to be some of the oldest geological formations in the region, dating back millions of years. These rocks have endured the tests of time, standing tall while the world around them evolved and transformed. The dense canopy and isolated location of these mountains suggest that they could be home to unique flora and fauna, possibly species that are yet to be discovered by science. The inaccessibility and treacherous terrain of the White Peak Range make them a formidable challenge for explorers and researchers. The presence of these hidden mountains challenges our understanding of the Amazon's topography. Their discovery opens up new opportunities for exploration and research, as they might harbor unique and undiscovered species and ecosystems. Number 3. Rare Pink River Dolphins The Amazon River is home to a remarkable and mystical creature, the Pink River Dolphin. This unique species of dolphin, also known as the Boto, or Amazon River Dolphin, is recognized for its distinct pink coloration and its ability to thrive in freshwater environments. Pink River dolphins are not only the largest freshwater dolphins on Earth, but also one of the few species that live exclusively in freshwater systems. Their pink color comes from blood vessels near the surface of their skin, which become more visible when the dolphins are excited or experience changes in temperature. These dolphins are surrounded by folklore and mythology in the Amazon region, where they are often believed to have shape-shifting abilities and magical powers. They hold great cultural significance for many indigenous communities. The study of these dolphins also plays a crucial role in our understanding of aquatic ecosystems in the Amazon. Their unique biology and behaviors continue to captivate scientists and researchers, shedding light on the mysteries of freshwater dolphins in this remarkable region. Number 2. Lost Tribes Deep within the remote Amazon rainforest, there are communities of people who remain untouched by the modern world. 
these uncontacted tribes are living remnants of an era before technology's reach, and their existence reflects the resilience of human cultures in the face of ongoing change. Comprising anywhere from 100 to 200 distinct tribes, these groups hold the secrets of a life entwined with nature, a testament to the resilience and enduring strength of indigenous cultures. The Amazon Basin, particularly in the northern regions of Brazil, is believed to be the home to the majority of these tribes, with estimates ranging from 77 to 84 distinct groups. The Brazilian government, alongside organizations like National Geographic, has taken strides in acknowledging and respecting the existence of these communities, weaving a complex tapestry of legal protections to safeguard their right to live as they choose. Gleaning insights into the lives of the uncontacted is no small feat, their knowledge, traditions, and ways of life are closely guarded, known mostly through the interactions with neighboring indigenous communities and the rare glimpses captured by aerial footage. These fleeting moments of connection offer a window into a world that stands as a living relic of the Amazon's rich cultural heritage. We've known about the presence of uncontacted tribes in the Amazon for many years, but their isolation continues to be a topic of great interest for anthropologists ethno-historians and conservationists. These tribes are believed to be descendants of ancient Amazonian peoples who deliberately stayed hidden from the outside world. For these tribes, the dense Amazon foliage acts as a natural barrier, and they themselves aim to maintain their traditional way of life. Efforts are made to respect their isolation since any contact with the outside world could expose them to diseases for which they have no immunity. Number 1. The Tallest Tropical Tree in the heart of the Amazon jungle, where the towering canopy stretches towards the sky, stands an awe-inspiring giant, the world's tallest known tropical tree. This colossal, a yellow Maranti tree, reaches a staggering height of 290 feet. The discovery of this enormous tree, appropriately named the Titan of the Amazon, was a significant achievement for scientists and conservationists. It was found in a remote, mostly uncharted region of the Amazon where a team of tree experts embarked on a challenging journey to document and measure this botanical giant. The yellow Maranti tree belongs to the Dipterocarpaceae family and is known for its exceptional height. The titan of the Amazon breaks all records for tropical tree height, further adding to the list of remarkable plant life found in the Amazon basin. This discovery is important not only for our understanding of the Amazon's biodiversity, but also for its role in forest conservation. The existence of such towering trees underscores the critical function of the Amazon rainforest in storing carbon and its potential impact on combating climate change. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you won't miss our next episode. See you in the next video.